All right, we're back here in the harbor. Got a little nasty out there. Come in here to get some bait. I'll take a minute and show you the features here, the Seapro 228. Here, first rod locker on the port side here. You come down in here and look. It has access for four rods, about a six foot rod, or you can put your brushes and, and gaffs in here. I removed it. There was a rack here to organize everything. These are insulated. It has a high strength shock right there. See how thick these doors are, these are solid glass. You can see how they hinge from the front so you can access the boat from the trailer. These are lockable. Come up here to the front, another high powered hinge, another insulated box here. This is one of the awesome features here. Nice thick lid here. You can put a five gallon bucket. We have our, keep our cast nets in here. You can keep your anchors in here. That's a great feature there. Here we got our garbage box again. These are all insulated. You can use these as fish boxes. You can insulate almost, I mean, you can throw ice in any one of these boxes and you'd be good to go. We got pop up cleats. We got three in the front, including the one up there at the bow. And the two back here. While you're up here, Charlie, let's look at the anchor box. This is a great design here. That's a big anchor. That's an anchor for a 31 foot boat. All the rope just stays on the side. Anchor locks right in there. You just drop it right in. No more finagling it around to try to get it to fit. All right. This is really cool. Just a battery box here. Everything is below the water line for your batteries. We have three batteries there for our trolling motor, 36 volt system. Those are group 31s below the water level here, which means stability. All right, got another cooler where you can plumb it for a live well. Another insulated box. It's nice and air, air and water tight, so I like to keep my valuables in there. Here's where our electronics are. There's a cushion that goes here and a back cushion. A lot of storage in here, a lot of good dry storage. I have toolboxes in there, life jackets, and all kinds of good stuff. All right, come on back here. All right, I showed this before in the video. We got some Menhaden back here from Bunker. Insulated live well here, I think it's about 16 gallons. Have our overflow back in the corner so these baits can swim around and have plenty of room not to knock into a pipe. More pop-up cleats. All right, this is cool here, the jump seats. What's nice about this, on a rainy or nasty day, these seats stay dry. Pop these up. Come down in here, we got our raw water wash down. Have all our planter boards and everything, a lot of storage down in there showed this before. No hinge here on the surface. So we can run around up here, throw the cast net, nice and stable. Okay, this here's a release well. It's not plumbed right now, but you can have it plumbed for release, release well right there at Seapro. Again, look how thick this glass lid is, man. It's solid. These rod holders in the pocket here are an option. You can have those in there. I actually did this with the Seapro uh, Applied rod holders, and I put these back here, and they like it so much that they're gonna offer it as an option. Over here, another live well in the corner. Great way to do it. Look at that. We got these nice big baits in here, and they've been in there for hours. Insulated, nice thick box, nice thick lid. Another jump seat here. Come look at that storage in there, all those boxes we have. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine boxes. Over here, battery lazarette over here. Nice fancy word for you. Check this out. Look at that. Is that awesome? Again, thick lid, got a gasket on it. This locks down. Over here, we've got our courtesy lights. 
We got four and a half spotlights, two in the back, one in the front. Show you inside the electronics box. I did all this, so that's kind of sloppy. And down over here, you got a little glove box here for your, your phone and your keys and stuff. All this lights up. I'll show you later on tonight. Put the courtesy lights on. Everything lights up blue. Lazarette has a lights in it. Has a light in it. The live wells have lights in them. The front uh, boxes have lights in them. I mean, it's just a, inside here has light. It's just a really it's a fishing machine is what it is. It's really well laid out though. 